with Life is Strange for episode four. The black dark room. That's what I say, black room. For the dark room. So, yes, as always, if you like this, hit the like button, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you guys know when I go live, I'm gonna upload all that good stuff. And yeah, so as always, let me share it about, and then we can get started. Yes. We'll get a wee, like, rewind catch up thing from probably first three episodes, but you know, either way. That'll be grand. So, yee yee. Swipe up for episode four. Right. That is it sent. So, we shall continue. Last night, we ended off on a, weir a bit of a weird note between Chloe and Previously friends. Previously on like... Life is Strange. Whoa! Also, yeah, it goes through all three episodes. You don't know reason. who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Let's talk about your superpower. Superpower is a bit of a stretch. What are you okay. doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now. It won't work. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. Miss Coffee, please tell us everything. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. Like you said, mm -hmm. it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and beat it. This Max, is what happened last episode. better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Being more than friends. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? No, you don't. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Hello? Are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Chloe, you have a visitor. Yeah, a lot of shit happened last episode. Good God. I have a strange story based game with feature player choice. I know. I played the first three episodes and all of the Batman Telltale, so can't understand how this shit works. <clears throat> Hello, people. Person. What is the crack? Square Enix. Don't entertainment or whatever the fuck it is. Yeah, there. Don't nod at entertainment as I call it. Can I can never skip these. Probably a good thing you can't put like name still. Life is strange. Episode four, the dark room. Oh, 
Chloe. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. I don't mean that in a, in a bitchy way. Not totally. It's understandable. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. Look, the worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. See? Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Yeah, well, she doesn't ever Those beached whales are so sad. Yeah. I kind of know how they feel. At least, mm -hmm. I'm alive here with you. Oh, Chloe. We need to kind of find out what happened You're to Chloe a real in survivor, this timeline. Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you Oof. remember everything? I, I saw it. Everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. Oh. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. You mean Rachel Amber? When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. I just read about her in the news. I didn't even know her name. You did? This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, mm. it's more like the end of the world. Do you think so? I uh, no. haven't kept up with the details. I have more time on my hands than you. Plus, I'm a science nerd. Yeah, but yeah. none of this makes sense. I know things seem out of control, but... As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. That's Hanging nice. out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe. Mm. I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. I was wrong. Indeed. You're my best friend. Max... Thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word, no offense. Like, None taken. Not punk, rock. punk rock. So... Such a different version of Chloe. To like what we're used to. Well, I'm used to from like the first few episodes. It's weird. The hair difference alone. Bloody mad. So, is there like does Max fucks unfuck up something, or how does that work, owner? Like, does she do something that reverts it back to the way it was, or? Something to that effect. Hmm. 
It's a pretty high tech lair. Feels like a high tech cell. Mm -hmm. But I am lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. When you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. Or when doctors mm. flip me around like I was a science doll. <laughs> I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? Right, so water is where? <coughs> Where the fuck do you go? The water is where? Come on, water. Here you go. Drink up, Buttercup. Oh man. No wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever Jeez. thought about doing a podcast or something? I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Ooh. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. You sound like an adult now. It seems like we were kids in another life. Mm. To me, it, it seems like yesterday we were little brats here, watching Power Rangers and destroying the kitchen. Ooh, oh, talk about Power Rangers. We covered everything in flour. Even my parents. That was so hilarious. <sighs> but a long time ago. Mm. You're the only person that I grew up with who visits me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Which friends did you hang out with the most? Megan Weaver, but you don't know her. She was cool. Mm. But after my accident, she was too cool for school. I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. How? Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. <laughs> I know this is a dumb question, but... Are you lonely here? Yes, dumb question. I don't mind being alone. I can't exactly go party like a rock star, though. Or get in 18 <laughs> trouble with the folks. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills are fucking insane. What do you expect, though? I bet. This tech must be crazy expensive. Along with the drugs, the nurses, the supplies. Mom and Dad are always broke, and they get so frustrated. Is it worth it? Chloe, you're priceless. Uh, <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> you are such a geek. That's why I love you. Of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> what do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember, Max. Swear I won't fall asleep. Not when you're here. Not yet. Oh. Alright, let's watch some Blade Runner. Ah, here's the DVD. DVD player. DVD.
Oh. Axe's like outfit is so different in this, like in this version of the like, this timeline compared to our normal like jacket, t-shirt, and sling, like, sling over thing, like, like bag combo, or postman bag combo. Hmm. We're probably both sleeping. Yeah. Huh. <sighs> Chloe's up before or Max is. <coughs> I cannot believe you fell asleep so fast. How dare you? I know you were beat down after the day with me. And mm. Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Uh, do you do you think Deckard is a replicant? Sorry, I can see you're not wide awake like me. No, I'm sorry I crashed so hard. Were you okay? I do have a mother and father when you're not falling asleep on me. Yeah, you well. are a bitch in the morning. It's the company I keep. Yeah, well. Yesterday was such a blast. It was great seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but... Being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates, jumping and running through the forests again. Aww. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you pretty please go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep this wag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. Well, get a move on. Morning, William. Just go on to go upstairs and grab the shit. Ah, oh, Victoria, what's up? Oh my room tonight, Max. I'm cool. Just wanna make sure. She walked away so fast. Nathan is right too. That's weird. But like I mean, there's ones from here. Water's not even could you swear. Don't do it again. Whoa. Taylor. It gets old, my stupid phone is about to die, so go. Nathan. Oh yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Chloe. And our mother. Huh. Bathrooms. In there? Yeah, in here. Switch. There you go. Right. Search. Nothing here. Probably open the cabinet then. It's cool that Chloe uses natural medicine too. This cabinet? The bathroom looks almost the same. Just more medicine. Mm hmm. Search the side. Here it is. I never thought I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. Right, Chloe, what am I doing? Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. I'm nosy, but not precise. 
Go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Wow. Of course, my pain just keeps getting worse. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so mm. grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. Oh, that's nice. See, I'm getting mushy. I'm already high. <laughs> You're so adorable. Do you want anything else? Um, stop me if I'm being too emo. But can you grab one of the photo albums over there? I'd like to check out some old pictures of us when we were kids. Please. Sure. My diary is like emo ground zero. Plus, Max Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. Where am I looking? A drawer? Oh my god. I made that mix for her when we were 12. Damn. Photo album. Take this one. That'll do. Right. Photo album. Is that okay? Perfect. Oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. Mm, I remember that day by the lighthouse. My dad was pissed at us. He actually tried to give us a time out. And you laughed at him. Yeah. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Can't exactly oh, look at them. Awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. You're not actually like focusing on the pictures. In oh case man, it, in there we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Literally seems like yesterday. Because Max, it was lost. for you. Me too. This photo. Yeah. Maybe I could. Listen, Max. My respiratory system is failing. Uh, and, uh, no. And it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So I know I'm just. Putting off the inevitable while my parents suffer along, and I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you be my last memory. Do you understand? Yes. Unfortunately, I guess. All you have to do is crank up the IV to 11. Ah, uh, I can't do that. I can't bring myself to do that. I don't know. I, I can't. Oh, wait. I, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wa wanted to end it all, and I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean, th there's got to be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. I want to help you, Chloe, but... I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do it. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once, I want to make my own choice. The most important one of my life. Please, help me, Max. I 
Except I, I can't walk oh, at all. I'll just drift asleep, dreaming of us here together, forever. Oh, I can't watch this. It's too sad. But like, I can't not watch it at the same time. Ah, I can't. 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 Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Sooner than you think. Oh, no. There's probably a way to, like, stop her from having the crash. Keep William alive. You would think. Oi. Ah, no, wait, whoa. Focus on the photo. I'm sorry, William. No, don't. Don't look at that photo. Look at a different one. Do I have to f redo this, really? She, like, at least it's not like a thing that Someday she Dad will get remember. one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Oh, this time I don't have to go through your person. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. I can't skip this either. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Jesus. Is she gonna burn the picture? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. She, and she no burnt Chloe the picture. and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. As long as we don't have to experience his death, then like... Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe... I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I... I did try. I'm sorry. She doesn't I don't know exactly like. what you're talking about, but... Come on. You have made things different, like, my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. So let's take us back to present day Max and Chloe, like from episodes 2 and 3, no, 1 and 2, and part of 3, yeah cause that's right there, that's gone, that Max has got, that one didn't push away, it's just, yeah no that's back. Her getting infected. How'd she get the truck then? Oh, Why it's back to that. Uh, okay, at least, at least, I guess, alive and well in this. Like. either, which is good. Glad. Well, 
both like Chloe's opinion on me is a tiny bit different. What the fuck? Where's this? Pictures of Kate Marsh. Oh, it's like probably in Chloe's room. Like they've got all the evidence. Yeah. Okay. Copyrighted music. You're alive. The yes. copyright music. Whoa, copyright whoa, music. down, Max. You get one kiss, now you're all over me. I'm just. I'm just. I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI mm -hmm. Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Shh. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome Bullshit, to Max. World, Max. I'm gonna get a copyright complaint, but I don't. Let's look at the big board anymore. and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Can I? Yeah, I can take a photo. Right. So, what'd she say I had to do? Ambient. Nice. Oh, what's okay, that? lost in all this shit. Hmm. So close, yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, what things? One, Typical. decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. Mm -hmm. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Darkroom. Nice. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. Not really. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> Don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. Exactly. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. Nice. And be careful of step crack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. So I have to get to the garage without him I exactly finding out. Oh, she was about to say something, but oh, shit. Is she gonna finish? Oh, fuck. Mr. whatever the fuck she said there. Dick. Right. Hmm. What's wrong with you, dickhead? You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you, ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Of course. Don't you wander off into the dark. She's here to, she's here to stay. Where's your boy Joyce gone? Look. Looks like David already booked a room. Alright, warn two text messages. I need to look at that. Those poor whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? Mm, fuck news. Right, I have to look at the SMS messages for oh, Chloe. If I so. Wait. No worries, I have. Beanie, swing around and pick you up. So you'd be ready. Okay. Juliet. I'm just bored talking, thanks. Hey, but you can't keep secrets from Ace reporting Juliet Watson. Oh, fuck off, Watson. Justin. Kate. Uh, I miss you, Anatomy Bunny. We all miss you, and Bunny misses you. Yay. Such a great friend. Thank you so much. Can't wait to see you. 
Mother. One plant was stressful enough. No. Back to the books, toxin. Warren. Or we could all go. One pain in the ass is enough, cool. At the jet TTYL. Chloe. No. Oh no, there is one more message there. From Faller. I'm just being a dad. Well, it's a week free. Right. Okay. Um. Garage. Oh, the door's been left open. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Mm, potentially. Right, the big puddle of fucking oil is still there, so... Should I have signed the petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. What do they say, Smithy? Um, hello, by the way. Uh, despite our rather heated discussion about the successful petition, Campus, I'm uh, still interested in your feedback and all the methods in protecting back while security and what's fine. Clean safety and friends. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. At least he has one weird fan. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Hmm. Map. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David hey, must be working for the Prescotts too. I'm glad you're you've joined. Right. I'm in the middle of trying to find clues. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. Well, I'm not fucking looking at that because I there's no point. Oh, that makes me sad. Six lines. It was so incredible to see away. William again. Go for it, Ben. I wish Chloe could too. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Mm, fuck knows. What is your question, Ben? How many 15 seconds going to 100? I don't know. I wonder if David is going to the party. Mm, fuck knows. Um, Ben, I do not know. Yeah, if you know the answer, please tell me. Locker. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Is in the, oh, oh, hey, David, what you hiding? IDK. Oh, look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I better move his plank. Excuse me. Just one picture, please. The eggs aren't there. What? Photos. Maths 100. Trying to figure out because Another photo from oh my God. Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Frick off of your Yu-Gi-Oh, Ben. Right. Hold on. I... Where the frick am I supposed to find stuff? I need to find keys or something to open them. I'm C starring for the last. Congrats, Ben. Take the crowbar. Okay. I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. Or I could take a screwdriver and just like like and a hammer to it, but like Oh fuck. Seven was it not seven one, seven one? I knew that number would be important. Haha! -ha. I remember things. Anything of use? A book. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Whoa. Oh, yes. And he's got a picture of him being fuck out of Warren. Ugh, okay. Score. Back to Chloe now. Okay. That can do. Just carry the crowbar in case I need it for something. 
It's amazing how much drama this living room has seen. Wait, why can't I? Yo, oh. Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. I have to Kate, go back. Nathan, play and Rachel. Now. She is here. Plus some location See you, Ben. I'll be on as soon as I can. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Good idea. Then go back, feed the rabbit, and go from there. This is definitely Hospital. Kate's floor. The hospitals always freak me out. I, I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Just go in there and be your friend. I'll wait out here so you can chill by yourselves. I was a total dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored yeah. me. I had no idea Indeed. what shit she was going through. No one and did. You saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Don't be, Chloe. You'd ever right to be pissed. Thanks, Chloe. But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Yay! Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes. <laughs> I'm on it. She'll tell her probably in a different way. She'll probably tell Chloe. Come on, Max. Open the door. <gasps> She's actually out of bed. Oh, that's nice to see. Oh. Max! Oh, oh. Kate. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, yeah. I'm doing even better. I'm Aww. so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Awesome content. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying, you made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate, awesome there content. are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping the balloons, though. One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. That's cool. I love your illustrations. They got kind of dark there for a while. But I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was thinking of having some photographs in there too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. Yes. I'm going to be here for another uh -huh. day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. That's what they're they do. so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. I was surprised how many fine. students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel, Mr. Jefferson, even yeah. Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm glad you believe again, Kate. I'm working on it, Max. I just pray I can get this drawing right. I want to properly have a look at these drawings. Oh, I love Kate's happy oh. rainbow flock. I miss my banana. Must look cat. Where is she? Here. Oh, that's adorable. Good to see that Kate is still working on her book report. Oh yeah. So. I kind of want to go around and look at these. Those are nice flowers. Oh. And from Taylor? Wow, props to her. Indeed. Kate, to... it is so good to hang out with you again. Max, it's I owe you days. so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. 
I'll talk I to always you. want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan like a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh yes, and cool. you could bring Warren along too. Oh, boys light. No boys allowed. <laughs> you are funny, Max, and right. Nathan. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. And mm. we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. Well, I did get his ass suspended, so that might be a start. You did? Oh, right on, Max. I love how fearless you yes. are. So what is going on with him now? Mm, goodness knows. Oh, I Prescott think his problem. family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I never say this about people, but Max, there's something evil about the Prescotts. They have something to do with death. We're going to stop him. Oof. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number, and I'll text it to you, okay? Of course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. I have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Tell no Alice problem. I'll see her soon. Oh well. Goodbye. That is so good to know that Kate is drawing again. I'll be sure to try and keep an eye out for some nice photos. Well, how is she? She's still Kate Marsh. Thank God. Oh. I'm glad we came to see her. Thanks well. for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. That little prick is not going to be glad when he sees us. Oh, he's going to get his ass whooped. Oh, oh. Nathan? No. Warren will probably end up having to go into the boys' dorm to get any information. Unless they're like half two in the morning. You know. Would be very useful. Or get someone else to go into Nathan's room. Oh, Samuel and me. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend Chloe. Yeah. Chloe, why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this school. It's a long story. And actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. Yes. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember... I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party, so I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Can Even I though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo, I understand your reasons. You can't no, no, force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. Can I not give him one? No. no pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend, and I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Oh, Just that's fine. get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. <laughs> Nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Hot really, floor boy. teacher. Gross! You are uh, out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be Good jealous God. because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. <laughs> Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Indeed. Maxine, let's get to work. What's the objective? Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. I'm going to talk to your dude under the tree. As I face through someone's head. Hey, Daniel. Oh, you look bummed out. Are you alright? Hola, Max. 
I just figured out that my photos basically suck. I'm a wannabe artist. Don't give up that easy. Just stay away from your sketchbook for a while. You need to keep taking the shot, as Mr. Jefferson says. Stay away from my sketchbook? You don't know me, Max. That's like Heck. you staying away from your camera. I think I'll just sit here bummed out, thanks. Ah, balls. I want to rewind that just to see. If hey, I can Daniel. Make feel good. Hola, Max. Like Maybe different. you should try different subjects. Something more like your portraits. That makes sense, but not if I can't choose the subjects in class. If only I could draw my photographs. I think I'll just sit here bummed out. Ah, frecky. Wait. Why didn't give me an opportunity to head back hey, for Daniel. a second? Hola, Mac. Can you give me another option? Draw your photos. Daniel, your drawings are your photographs. So draw your photos with your eyes and make the camera your lens pen. Lens pen? Oh, I dig that, Max. That could work for me. Indeed. <sighs> I do feel better now. You are good, Max. Nathan. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. Yeah, but he's still gotta be on campus. That explains why he looked so pissed off when I saw him leaving campus a few moments ago. Okay. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't talk to anyone, Max. But I did actually have a nice talk with Brooke. She couldn't stop talking about how brave you were on that roof. I don't think doing the right thing is brave, but I appreciate what she means. The most important thing is that Kate gets better. Exactly. And gets justice. I hear that, Max. She's the sweetest, most genuine person I've ever met. I don't mind getting picked on by Blackwell bro holes, but don't fuck with Kate. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. Only Daniel if I can Costa. start the revolution from my sketchbook, Max. Make sure you got enough pamphlets and Are you going fine. to the end of the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here Push me into lockers, not dance floors. We should go. That's exactly why you should go to that party. We have to stand up to these Blackwell bullies for Kate. You won't be alone, Daniel. Not with you to back me up, Max. Oh, damn it. I will go to the party like it is the end of the world. Yeah. Okay, maybe I won't go, but... No, I won't do that, but... I'll go. Let's talk later. Okay, Daniel? Good. Hurrah. Nathan is not around. Right. I should go back to Chloe. Oh, oh, it's been checked. so long since Hello. I've seen you. Because you're way That's too cool for us now, bro. I want to go over and chat to this person. That's so ironic that Warren asked. Brooke. Hey, Brooke. How are you? I'm here as usual. By the way, thanks for helping Kate down. Are you okay? I'm fine. I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Ah, Come on, bugger Brooke. off. Don't be that way. Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, Max. I Oof. might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Oh, really? fuck off. I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. Oh, piss off, Brooke. I don't even want to try that. Time to go clean up graffiti from those kids. Hello, Max. Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. Yay. I'm still bragging about you and the other students making Blackwell surveillance free. Mm -hmm. I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. Hey, 
hell no. Sorry, Miss Grant. You're an adult. You can swear, damn it. And I'm glad you did. So Yay. I haven't seen Nathan at all. Let's just say I try not to, Max. But I did catch him storming off campus. That's After what happened saying. this week, I hope you don't see him either. You're not the best student here, but you, you might be the wisest. Kate. I don't think surveillance would have helped Kate Marsh. Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did Detective a wonderful Max. thing. And now we have to make sure Kate gets the help she needs. Oh, she will. Do you need to talk to a counselor? Nah, I'm ground. No thanks. Uh, no, no thanks, Miss Grant. I have my best friend and my parents. For now. I'm happy to hear that, Max. Just don't ever be afraid to talk to somebody, okay? Okay. I wish Kate had come to me. I had no idea what she was going through. No one Kate did. was drugged at the Vortex Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that damn Vortex Club for a start. No, no. I don't mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. Oh, yeah. Prescott's. Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? I mean, they don't get all their money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges. Especially when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. Convenient. This elitist nonsense has no place here. You're right. I, I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about before I came here. I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. But you're all too young to be so cynical. Exactly. But you truly give me hope. Recent events. I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. Oh, if I could, things. I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. <laughs> I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. There must be a scientific explanation, right? When my friends for? at NASA tell me they can't explain a solar eclipse without a single theory as to how or why, Maybe it's time to get worried. Like they are. Fuck. I am worried about reality. I feel like it's changing right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's mm -hmm. not mystic. It's erosion. Yeah. You think that's why all these animals are dying here? Well, our shoreline has been receding. Not to mention the daily contamination of the ocean. That's all you need to kill off sea and wildlife here. Unless you know something I don't. I wonder if the Tabanga knows more than anybody here. Oh, Max, nobody even knows who brought the Tabanga here. It was likely stolen from the South Pacific by local fishermen. But I know what you're saying. There's a lot of energy here. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Right, clue. What's happening? What's that? Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you uh, suck. Piss off. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Oh, this is a, a meal. It, eh? Or is it like upstairs the boys and downstairs the girls or what? I don't know how this works. It's so lame they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. I don't know, this is the meals. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Batmax! Now I just have to find na -na 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 Nathan's room. Na -na 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 Batmax. Vortex Club sucks up. Oh, that's Evans. Kate. Supermax, in case you still need it, Nathan's room number is 111. Get your awesome thanks. This is, of course. Aha! 
Kate is literally a lifesaver. Ah, oh, Kate brings it. So room 111 is the magic number. Indeed. Let's go rules time. This can only be Nathan's room. Even if she hadn't have sent anything. It's locked. One way to get into a room. Slightly gaggy looking, but anyway. Now I need to find Nathan's phone. Or anything with clues. Joyce, what's up? Max, now that David's not here, I need clues. Step up and stop acting out so much, but it won't be happening with you and her getting mixed up. And they go crap like breaking into Blackwell and Leia. I know it happens, so don't bother to defend or explain. Help get her back on the right track. She could influence on her unless she both want to play bad. She can't be blaming David back. I'm sorry, Joyce, even if you get shenanigans. Even I get into shenanigans. I don't know, Max, don't forget. She's still a teenage at all. Eh, might have. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. Oh. Thing must fail. Shit. Nathan is way into this party. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Fuck. You Oh man. Too bad Nathan yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Look. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Nathan likes his tortured subjects. These films all have a dark pattern. Hmm. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Feeling Chloe's gonna be like, fam. Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. I get the fuck before it happens. Now I okay. There's definitely a door map around here. Wait. Yeah. Where, what am I doing? Where am I going? Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, yeah, what did you find? Things. His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Oh! Hey! What are you doing in my uh, dorm? Not your dorm, but anyway. You're such a nosy bitch, Max! Stop right there, Nathan! Make me ho! Warren. Max, I got this. No, you really Get don't. Get the fuck out of like... my face. <sighs> Good one. You <sighs> are so fucking dead. <sighs> Get off me, bro. <sighs> Come on, Warren. Kick the shit into him. Oh, stay out of it. Let him have like it. To hurt people, huh? Like Max. Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Warren, that's a bet much, okay? Get off me! Please! Please stop! He's down! Hey, come on! Stop! <laughs> Sorry. Yes, we have to go. 
Who's the bitch now? Chloe! I probably should have stopped him. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was... I know it was good but scary, but like... It was worth it slightly. I want Damn. to say it was worth it. That was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. No. Not yet. Uh... So, maybe you better, um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes. Don't walk into something. You are. I was about to say, don't walk into something because then it will make it a bit more embarrassing. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. That's true. Doesn't like I said. Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. That's a good idea, Max. Mm. All right, where are we meeting him this time? Down at the beach. Oh well, yeah, because he drives an RV. Can, like, it's not just a camp or a Polo things. Camper van. The, the trailer thing. Carva. Carva. God. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole's gonna help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. <laughs> and I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. But you really should. Just... There's no way hey, you there's a little, this is what uh, will happen to us when we grow up. Face thing in the back of the wing mirror. I'm Ooh. looking forward to the day when we can just go can on a road trip to don't... Portland. Like Fuck yeah. Cool face type you, me, things. and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Chloe? No second thoughts. Just want to keep up where. Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. That's true. Alright, Clay, come on. Let's get this over and done with. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? You have money. There are a few questions to add on top of it. Oh, I thank you. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And let's not do any more business again. Now, if you excuse me. Hey, Frank. 
Could we ask you a couple quick questions? Please. You have some serious lady balls. No. Jesus, okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. I don't know. Frank, we're not here to get high. No. You don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? <laughs> Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Uh, I'm sorry. Listen, Frank. I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. I... That was self-defense. I am so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. I, I try not to. And I never would have pulled the trigger. I was just... Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay. We're cool for now. But my dog is... Yeah, and if boy. you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? Mm. Oh, Pompadour is so cute. The only way you know my dog's name is if you broke into my RV. That's how we got out. You did it. Are you crazy? That's my dog. Wait, that's not what... Seriously, Frank, don't get all spun out. We're only here to find Rachel. Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now. Especially from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? What are you hiding, Frank? You should want to help us, not scare us away. Don't you accuse me of anything. You don't know me or who I am, or what I can do, you understand? Huh? Man, there is something about you that is so wrong. I don't trust you at all. Now get out of my face. We don't have much time, Frank. Rachel needs you. It's too late, she's gone. You don't even know her. Like you did? I loved her, asshole. And she loved me. I know that. Chloe, you don't know shit. You were part of her problem. Always trying to take her away from me. Always! Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch! Get it! Set the fuck back now! <laughs> Pompidou! You fucking killed my dog! Who shot first? It's like a hand solo thing. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, I don't fall. Okay. Oh, Chloe. We need to rewind and redo oh, some no. of that shit. Chloe. Let me rewind. I just shot a man and his dog. Frank Bowers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it was self-defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. I know, but we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. 
If I can find it, then we'll just rewind. That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Come friend. Here. I'm sorry. Chloe, Max, can you not rewind this? Do I, do I get the opportunity to rewind? Jesus. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself. Or forget this. And I can't only afford. I can change it. I don't want Frank to die. Just for Chloe's sake. She'll get a little factor too much. Right, Chloe, can I chat to you before we do this? No. Wait, no, Chloe left it, so... Ah, I don't... With Chloe left in it, does that mean that I don't actually have the code because, well... Listen, Chloe. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Not. Watch your mouth, be careful, get rid of the gun. Please watch your mouth. You have no social skills here and you will piss off Frank immediately. You kind of love this, don't you? Fine, I'll try being like you for a change. Or how either. you used to be. Oh, shut up. I would say get rid of the gun, but then we'll probably need it for a later stage. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. Why can I skip this? You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? There you go. Close door, no fight, no weapons, no fight. Thanks for hearing me out, Frank. Look, we only want to talk, and it's not even about you. We're not here to start a fight. No, that shit would be over pretty fast. Don't fuck with me, and I won't return the favor. So what do you want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I, I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. Frank, we didn't come here to f Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled up. Uh, self-defense. Finally, self I believe you. I... I try not to. D dude, she was scared. We're cool. We're only here to talk. Shit, you wouldn't have time. Right. Dog rescue. Give a bone. Dog a bone. Dog rescue. Of course I do. I heard you even rescued a bunch of fight dogs. That's amazing. No, all right. It was just the right thing to do. I couldn't stand to see those poor animals treated like, like slaves. Well then. That's how I came to own Pompadou. That's very cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now? Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now. Especially hmm. from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. But I, I just want... You know Rachel? Rachel's ladder, bracelet. You have Rachel's bracelet. bracelet. You obviously know more than you're telling. So tell us. Never come into my home and tell me what to do. Understand? Man, oh, there is something about me. you. We don't have much time, Frank. Rachel needs you. It's too late. She's gone. You don't even know her. Like you did? I... Uh, Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me... Oh, all this shit again. Chloe, I need to rewind and do that again. I need to be as kind as possible.
possible. So much water in your mouth, anyway. Uh, it's like look, the one from last night. The rewind sequence all over again. I can tell you, Max. I should have known. Get rid of the gun. You won't like this, but you need to get rid of that gun. No, Max. I don't like that at all. But I trust you. And girl, if I need that gun, you better rewind fast. I'll intend to. Skip. Blah blah blah. blah. Get money. Uh, close the door. No weapons. <sighs> Frank, um, after our last meeting, I don't want any weapons involved. Could you put your knife or whatever in the RV until we're done talking? After you pulled a fucking gun on me, you want to negotiate my safety? I didn't trust you before, and now I do less. Of course. By the way, never tell me what to do in my home. Maybe I don't have a fancy Arcadia Bay house, but this is my turf. Got it? You're goddamn lucky you paid me back. So what do you want? Just the names of... Oh, is that... Yeah, you don't get it. Help us. I'm sorry. Listen, Frank. I'm sorry to be such... Yeah, yeah, every... There's Everyone's no time... Good. Yeah, yeah, well, it all... Come on, Frank, this... Right, okay. Frank. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. fight. I... Finally, I believe you. I... Yeah, I get... Dude, she was scared. Self-defense. We're cool oh, for shit. now. <clears throat> Dog We're only isn't... here to... Yep. Shit, you wouldn't have time. Of course I do. Of course I do. No, all right, it was just the right... I think you do. That's very... Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel. Rachel. Yes. You and Chloe. Ah. Uh, you know Rachel. Frank, you knew Rachel almost better than anybody. And you know more than us. Together we could find her. Do you have anything to lose? When Rachel vanished, I pretty much lost everything. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. Please. We really need your client list. Well, if there's a chance in hell you two dorks can find Rachel, I'll take it. My Thank dog you. isn't barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. That is indeed. Thank you so much. Frank. We'll let you know ways up. Ooh! Got the gun too. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Frank. Seriously. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. Thank you. She got her gun back, so... Okay, still loving this time. She really taking the other gun back? She doesn't need two guns. That uh, was cool Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. Right, Chloe, let's get down to business. Right, leave the beach. Let's see what happens next. Alright, let's see. This is in Chloe's house, okay. Credit card, phone. Different bits and bobs. Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen. I could tell you how it could have went, but you know, don't 
want to tell her. I better to... focus on this board. Gather a character. Gather info on a character by collecting correct clues for each section. Specific number. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. All right. Uh, what? Max is no wait. Deselect. Nathan's pictures. Max's pictures. What? what the f paper. Paper. That. That. And coordinates, maybe? That? <sighs> no. Nope. This is not working. Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. Damn. I, I must have missed something. Map? This is nope. like goddamn math. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Spies are us. Maybe if I deselect them to go to that one and Nathan's pictures. Oh, no. Deselect that. Select that. And then the map. Those clues are not related. Well, Nathan's plate and that kind of are. Looks like this isn't the right combination. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Oh, you're treading water, Otter. Try again. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Right, look. Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. L G H T Z N. That has to be in something, right? I can actually look at everything. Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? Anderson, Barry. Um. Uh, coordinates. Through. David really has been it's on Rachel's scary. ass for a while. She should have been upset. Hmm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. At least David was finally going after the right suspect. Well, in the second picture, it's got the, the, the truck. So... Okay, this is just sad, Max. Why is it sad, Max? Maybe it's a glad, Max? No? no? This makes no sense, Max. Well, I don't know. I hope in this case that David has good tracking skills. That's just a lot of shit. And that's all she wrote. <sighs> Please let me find some clues about Nathan in here. Indeed. Please, indeed. Right. One message from Frank. Hi, Max. Just want to see how your search was going. Thanks, Frank, for getting closer. I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by later if you both want to party and good luck. Oh, it's like, um... Frick. What do you call him? The dad out of frickin' Detroit. Great. Now, uh, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Uh, Pesh, I don't know. Right. That. And... Huh. Who else was David tracking here? Oh, wait, which one? Yep, yeah, another car David was tracking. Why the hell are you following these people? And that one. to where? Yeah, it's this one. Fail. Abort. Wrong oh. clues. Come on. To do Nathan. Oh, Interesting. Right, right, right. Is this ZR. Nathan's car? It's easier. Max, there's no logical link between those clues. Well, it's TZN, not TZ. Oh. That's definitely Chloe's car. TZR. Oh. 
come on. It's the first one. This is like goddamn math. I suck. Well, oh, TZN. Yeah. Deselect that. And select this one. Okay. Nathan's taillight is busted. And I'm pretty sure I saw that on one of the license plate photos. Oh yeah, if I deselect that one and select this one. This makes no sense, Max. Hi! If anything, it makes perfect fucking sense. Okay, this is just sad, Max. Right, hold on. That? Okay, Nathan's taillight is busted. And I'm pretty sure I saw that on one of the license plate photos. Yes, this huh. one. Who does this car belong to? That's different again. Right, deselect that one and select this one. <gasps> no. This is not working. No, it is not. What about this one? Wow, sir. This looks like an expensive machine. Probably Mr. Jefferson's. Like, oh, you're this. treading water, Otter. Try again. N-D-R N-O-R. Look. N-D-R. Try that. Oh, yes. Now there we're finally you. getting somewhere. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. Because that's all Nathan's credential stuff that is possible to get. You shouldn't have to worry about David now. Getting up and all a grill. Nathan's clues investigate these. Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Uh, which one's that? This Frank one? is for sure the local dealer, but I, I doubt. So, what happened to Rachel after this? Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Yep. There's no doubt she loved him in some way. Maybe Rachel took a road trip. So weird how close they were. Hmm, Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. Wait. No, is it that one? Yeah. That. No. Yes, the game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. I used to get this bitch. Let's Thanks. see if I can find any... Okay, Max. Remember these names and see how Nathan fits in with all this. So, Rot is Nathan. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. That explains a lot. Uh, golden Retriever, German Shepherd, Beagle, Archer Straight. Oh, that one's not in use. This one? Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. There's he could open a store. There's a rot in that one. Huh. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. This one? I'm getting a contact high just reading this. Nope. This I wonder one? what dog name Frank would have given me. Yes. Here we go. These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Uh, that's Max, it, Max. I know we can snap all these pieces together. Roger yeah. that. I'm gonna study the board and try to connect all these dots. What's next? Uh, Nathan's clues. I the have to analyze on. Nathan's messages. What could help? Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Oh, okay. Oh, so busted. Holy shit. That's a lot of numbers. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Right, I'll look at this again to see. Can I not, like, we have to select four things? This is the first. Vortex Club party where Nathan dr <sighs> There's a lot of numbers in here. It's like that one. That one. It's phone. Uh, if there so. is a dark room, we better find it. It's a good thing Chloe slipped all these files on her flash drive. Smart one, Chloe. 
Okay, Max. Let's go. blow this code up and go home. Any? Any? Look. Investigate. Let's start hacking. There's a mess. Get ready to fucking day, bitches. You fuck up my dorm door. I kill you. Shh. King. Okay. Um. My phone unlock. Oh, I actually need to get one of the numbers from here. Is this three nine eight or nine three three? Try three nine eight eight. Oops, bad code. Sugar. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. I don't know. Oh, nine five three five. Nine five three five. You locked it, dumbass. Do I have to rewind. Okay, there we go. Zero zero five eight. I'll try. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. What numbers are on this document? Home phone, cell phone, work phone, phone. So, 0198's there, and then 1010's there. Phone. 7A, no, if I try 0198, maybe? 01. Oops, bad code. Once again, and I fucking locked it out. Probably. 7063, is that on this? No. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Uh, paper. There's one five four two there. Three nine nine or three eight three nine eight eight. Oh, oh, I've done all of these four four three six five. Four, have I tried five four three one yet? I probably have. But. You locked it, dumbass. Hey. Stop putting yourself down, Max. Right, there we go. Has to be one of these bloody numbers somewhere. Then. Phone. Right. Seventy sixty three. Come up twice. I'll try ten ten and then eighty six oh three. Ten ten. <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. And then eighty sixty three was it? You locked it, dumbass. Uh. Eighty-six oh three, not eighty-six oh three. Eighty-six oh three. Oops. Bad code. Uh. Sugar. Right. Look. Is that a seven pen? Maybe quadruple one. Try that. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that yeah. easy. Okay, shit. Maybe the last numbers in the last digit seventy oh eight. No. You locked it, dumbass. Once again, stop it. Stop. Wanna just rewind as far as I can. So what numbers have I not tried yet? 1995? I doubt it, but like. Oops. Bad code. 
fuck. Paper. There's no more numbers in this. I have to try. 95. I've done 9535. 4436. 5, 1. 542. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. What's the last digit in red? Um, five, four, three, one. You locked it, dumbass. Ah, shush. Uh, sugar. I don't know. I don't know. I really do not know. Uh, uh for fuck's sake. haven't I tried to be fair like the only thing I can think of trying is his birthday August 29th which be 0829 you sure that's 28th yeah 0829 hey that worked oh shit What's up? Need a G? Okay, cool. Bet she sold me water, asshole. Can to bring it to me. Bring it. Stay away, pigs on the beach. Yes! Uh, this is all oh, about Nathan God. trying to score for the Vortex Club party. You home? Home. On the way. <sighs> Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. <sighs> he didn't hey, have enough I need, drugs. I need to score ASAP. I don't make house calls. No car, no time. Charge your double. Damn right, here, cash on you. I have cash on you, no fucking around, give me the address. I'll call to give you the extra dir exact directions. In transit, Drug dealer wish. drama. Book me shit, what you need? I'm right prices, don't make me wait. Our Vandex still need more stuff you home. This don't come from God, Nathan. Hey, You're out of control. So it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Yeah, no, Nathan. Know. It's time for you to watch out. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Work. I've told you this is a business, not just hobby. They treat you like an adult. Yeah, get on. Damn, son. Damn, son, indeed. Right, Clomeister, what are we doing? Take a breath, Max. Go through all this data, and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. That's a lot of shit. Like, look at this bit. Uh, Rot Blackwell. If Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. Alright, so I'll do this one. 5.40 p.m. 10th of the 4th. Was Frank meeting Nathan at the junkyard? Wait, what did I say? Eh, come on. 5.40 p.m. I'm going for 5.40 p.m. 5.40 p.m. That beach PM. is like Frank's main office. Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. Five, <laughs> Poor four, rich Nathan. I know Nathan wasn't looking for Bigfoot. Oh, on, Not that? much out there. 5.42 a.m. Somebody is stocking up on gas. There's Why? There's 10-4. No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. 
So he could be hiding clues there too. Tenth or fourth at five. Here, if I do that one and then this one, it would kind of make sense. Oh shit! There's more up the top. Oh shit! Wait, what is it saying? This thing got Fireblood Lane. Oh, that's a lot. Coke. Right. No. No. Uh, but, but, uh, didn't actually tell on that one. Didn't say anything there either. Looks like they this one then, I would say. Okay, this is just sad, Max. Oh, class no, then. If I can match one of the text messages and transactions with oh, fail, abort. Wrong clues. Since Kate left the party early with Nathan, I should search for texts, and locations, and transactions in the evening. Damn. I, I must have missed in something. Even at 5.26 p.m. That's the closest, is it not? Not this one. This makes no sense, Max. That's too late. That's too early. That's too early. Ten to that's yeah. There's only four of them. That's the closest one. Max, just match the right text message with the right account book entry. Then you'll finally discover where Nathan took Kate. Five forty PM. Firebud Spade and Coke. Nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. As I said, that one's too late. What time is this one again? That was too late as well. No, well, in saying that, there's two... There's five of those there, so... If I deselect that and deselect that, and start up here with the text messages, 10.50pm, I'll do that, and then look at these to see if it... 3.50pm... 10 p.m. 9th of the 3rd. Doesn't do the text, but dates in the text messages, surely. No, it's 10th of the 7th. 10 7. That's not right. 10 7. 10 50 p.m. I just need to look for 10. 10 7. On this. Oh, one I'm pretty sure seven. everything happened during that last Vortex Club party. So not that one. When was that again? That's not it. That's not it. This one has to be. Looks like this isn't the right combination. Uh, okay. Max, there's no logical link between those clues. Oh. Mm. Kate was completely out of it that night. Nathan must have used strong shit to knock her out. Potentially? Ah, uh, it must be this one. Those clues are not related. Hi! If I can match one of the text messages and transactions with Frank, then I can find the exact location. 10.50 p.m., 10.52, 10.51, 10.50. Closest 10.50. Whenever it's like ten fifty PM, it's that. No, it's not even that because Oh my head's starting to get fucking fried with us. Ten fifty. That was five forty two AM. Oh, it's eight PM. It said nineteen PM. That was the wrong date. 1042 is as close as I can fucking well get. <sighs> no. This is not working. It's not. Maybe I just have to do, deal with a different set of text messages or something. Maybe there's another one, even more, another one of them. 107 on it. 3.50 p.m. 
Fuck. Not said 10:50 p.m. Be 10 a.m. Night. 3:50 p.m. I need to look through. Stop selecting the same thing. God damn it. 3:50 p.m. Fifty PM. She's playing for three fifty PM on one of these blooming things and I should be right. Ah. Uh, this is starting to confuse me. That's the one that I was looking at there before. Three fifty PM. Rot Blackwell. Two sheets. Skitter or else. Alright. No, that's the weed one. Right. Do we select like that? Uh the skitter acid. No, that's AM, not PM. Alright, shit. Alright. What date was that though? Seventh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, no, no. Don't make me. What the fuck? It? Ah, shit. I have to reselect. So that says 10 to 7 at like shit o'clock in the morning. Just 3.50 pm though. That's, oh, stop selecting the same thing. That's too late. That's not it. There we go. That has to be it, right? Yeah. Oh, I just want to. Uh, three ten a.m. Jesus. 10 a.m. Looks like this is not relevant at all. Oh, it's the wrong text messages in. I need the one with a coke in it. Uh. Shh. Let's scrape it on once. Late. It's getting too late. That's too early. Why did none of these match up for? Since Kate left the party early with Nathan, I should, I should search, search for, text. for texts, locations, and transactions in the evening. All right, so evening time, not scrape a bloody morning dawn ones. Until dawn ones. Right, early er, evening ones. That's an evening one. This is evening. We've got to party tonight. Right. Yeah. That could be it, maybe? Uh, what about this top paper over the top one here? Right. What's in the description? I need you. Right, tenth of the fourth at like tenth of the fourth, tenth of the fourth. Doesn't actually tell you right enough. Eleven PM. I'll attach that one for ten twenty four, tenth of the fourth. So this infamous party was the fourth. No, it's eleven PM, that's too lit. Must be this one then. Uh, this is frying my fucking bop. Um.
brick, right? This is proper taking the push here, so. Uh, da 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 da. So, do they select all second huddle? So, there's five of them, five of them, and two, four, six, eight of them. Holy shit. It's taking a lot longer than I was expecting. I don't know. I need to find one though. Not like crap. Can it? 9:50 p.m. I was trying to do it with 9:50 p.m. on it. Like so that sort of night time. 3:10 a.m. 10 p.m. 5:40 p.m. That's too early. 10:50 p.m. And 11 p.m. Select that one. Tenth of the fourth at eleven PM. Tenth that's uh, tenth of the seventh. Tenth of the fourth at nine fifty four PM. Oh, you're treading water, Otter. Try again. Select, select. This is like goddamn math. I smack just match the right text message with the right Are account. Looks counter? like this is not relevant at all. Max, there's no logical link between those clues. Well, I don't know. Okay. Oh, damn it. Why is this so, here? So, this infamous party was the fourth. Yes, it was. Tenth or third. It needs to be one of the evening ones, though. Alright, 3.10 a.m. Any of these with 3.10 a.m. on it. What date? 10th of the 7th. No, that's not got it on it. 7th to the early in that. Doesn't have one on it. Doesn't have one on it. 3.10 a.m. Alright, what text messages are 3.10 a.m.? Oh, goodness, right. That's 302, 306. 527 p.m. Not once too early, so. I'm pretty sure everything happened during that last Vortex Club party. Uh -huh. When was that again? When? Oh. Um, so, this infamous party was the fourth. So, it needs to be after 8 p.m. Actually so, say this infamous party was the 4th. October 4th. That's 10th of the 4th. Oh, it needs to be the night of it, so it's... 1, 10, 10, 4 on it. 10, 7. I can select that one for the time being. Right, I can't. Ah. Uh, God. That's 10, 4. That's also... No, that's later, or earlier. It needs to be after 8 o'clock though, you would think. Uh, I'll go with this one. Alright, come on. 9pm, nope. Nope, it's not that one. That's 10 7. That's too early. 5.40pm. Nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. Alright, I need to find... Deselect that a second. 5.36 Oh, you're treading water, Otter. 
Try it. Kate was completely out of it that night. Nathan must have used strong shit to knock her out. Uh-huh. You're saying... That's probably the wrong thing. Okay, this is just sad, Max. If I can match one of the text messages and try... Oh, no. This is not working. Just... Trial and error, Max. Trial and error. Is it this one? No. That was the day before. I think that would be enough to, like, do it. Right. Deselect that. Deselect everything for the moment. Where's the other... Uh, oh, it's the top one on these, isn't it? Aye. Damn right. Right. So, what time here it is at? 10.20 four ish well not fourth it's eleven it's ten fifty five forty that's not helpful where's that be ten AM eleven PM maybe that should that should be right right no Nope. Uh, no, that doesn't have that on it anywhere. Sugar lumps, sugar lumps, sugar lumps, sugar lumps. Four at six twenty-three p.m. There's no fourth on that one. There's a fourth in that one. Hey, finally, Chloe. Oh, this is definitely the place. Let me pick up some more clothes here. And here's that bomb one. Holy shit. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. There's some shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. The kids. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. Prescott. I'm shocked. Should Same. we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody, except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. Just the I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We, can make we have to find our Max. We will. But remember, my power I isn't infinite. Probably sing that better, we still have like, to be careful. You know. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes. Yes, sir. Is. Yes, sir, Lee Bob. Hmm. Is there anything else to this episode, or is that just going to be it? That could have been a l about 20 minutes, like, shorter. This stream could have been 20 minutes shorter if I hadn't figured that out. But I was stupid. I was just trying to throw shit together. Holy shit, this is scary. Yeah. I know. But we're here. Let's go find the best way in. Actually, you don't have the crowbar from earlier. Like, earlier, no. Or did you throw that away? Or put it in the car. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. Then we need to get in that barn. If she knew, she could have tried. She knew what type of tires they were, because not all tires are the same. Hmm. These are thick tracks and definitely fresh. Nathan's SUV? Likely. Warren! Didn't realize I'd been the shit out of someone with bruised my fists, of course. Proved his face worse. They had a common whole, a whole fight with Cincy. So, how are you doing? Amped up. Uh, I wanted. I wouldn't want to do it again unless I had to. You paid your hero juice. No. We just need costumes. Speaking of, I hope you're coming to the party tonight so we can celebrate. 
I'll let you know, Prowls. Cool. I have to get back to striking super potions. Wow. Okay. Good afternoon. Chloe is so damn fearless. Why? Where does that come from? Hello, Mr. Squirrel. I'll take the fucking rake thing there. Probably find it squeeze or not. I'll walk through it. Chloe! I found the front door! Come on! Well, I wouldn't call it a front door, but you know. Anyway. Oh yes! Maximus rules. God, this is way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. Lots with all the fucking references. Hey, check out this old chest. Ooh, yes. A little louder, Chloe. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, no, look closer. Harry, Aaron, Prescott, and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescott's bring bomb shelter boom to town. My scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. Right. Because I'm a stupid idiot, I had to get in yes, my... Yes, old Prescott clippings. <sighs> but that can't be the only thing here. Obviously not. I kind of have a rough idea oh, what the fuck I'm the doing. good old because, days. Um... I say a rough idea, but like I have a very, very vague idea on what the fuck I'm supposed to do for the simple fact that if a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. With Boring. the whole Boring. needed a bit of help from the interwebs about that last section. So I googled it quickly and yeah, it happened. Wow, sir. So talk about home on the range. Jesus Christ, I'm no one your weapons. But um yeah, Okay. I, I know There's what I'm no for reason for section. anybody to drive out here, <sighs> but there must be. Great. I guess the Prescotts were just born bastards. I'll keep the year 1903 in my head, just in case. No, not even really, just in case. I'm looking for a. Scope out the perimeter. This mass. tractor has paid its dues. It's a keypad of some form. I don't have a fucking clue where it's supposed to be, but. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Everyone was. Nobody actually called them selfies until you, Max, but like, I claim this. So search. many haystacks, so many hay, so many, so, so many haystacks, so few needles. Petty parkour wasn't a thing. She probably needs to ask Chloe to like help her up there or something. Chloe would make a great detective too. I actually like tell Chloe I uh give me a boost or something right now. Oh, there's more shit, look. There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Scope out the perimeter, Max. There has to be more here than this crate. <sighs> Nothing no here. Oh, okay. Thought the, I thought you found a trap door the way you did that. Anything? Nope. Maybe here? Must be something. Oh. Yep. What is this? It's totally brand new. Why? These hooks are used to lift haystacks. I saw them in a Friday the 13th movie. No, Supermax. You can't open this with your bare hands. Why not? Okay, Chloe. Um, I, I found some kind of hatch, but it's locked. I got this. I hope. Let me know the second you need any help. Try the There's no way this rusty ass button will no. activate these ropes or pulleys. Try and fucking find out. So, 
I need to probably get up there and like the platform to climb. Chloe, can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Something like that. Hop up and away, Super Max. I dig having minions. A minion, not that, I should say. <laughs> Ah, that, that's a counterweight. That looks sturdy enough to stand on. Nope, stand on it then. There you go. Right, so that thing's attached up there. And it moves across, and the rope's here. Okay, pull. Nope. I can't pull this rope without tearing my flesh off. I need to hook this up to something heavier. Uh. Hook it up to a box or a big ass fucking thing that you pull down. Look, um, can I hook it to that green thing there? No. Oh, Tell shit. me if you need any help. Okay, I will. That looks sturdy enough to stand on. Yes, Max. I know. He already said that. Jesus. Right. What about this? Thing. No. Photo. Why not? Just no. Hello, Mr. Owl. How are you? Right. Manually exposed. Okay. Interesting name for an achievement, but anyway. Oh, look. Here's the other end of the rope. Yes, I know. What am I for attaching it to you, though? That's my question. Um, I don't think you would attach to the thing down there. Here's the other end of the rope. I know. Just tell me what the fuck I have to attach it to. Hi, Chloe. I don't know. Help. <coughs> Max, use your rewind and get that motor back up there. Uh, okay. Thanks, Max, for telling yourself that. Might as well do the quick rewind. See, this is why I like the little things. Wait a second. Oh, I was going to say what the fuck. Attach. Play the rope sturdy enough. Should be. Like, kick it. Push it. Huh? Oh. One way to do it. Max Giver strikes again. Parkour. <clears throat> Parkour. Right. Walk out around it, Max. There you go. Open. Open sesame. Damn, this is heavy. A stick. What is this? Jackpot. Do I even need to say how weird this is? Nope. It's just pretty did. fucking weird. Who built this kind of place? A Prescott, of course. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Right, let's follow Chloe in just to see what the frick is happening here. This bunker is so surreal. There's a keypad, but like... Oh! Ah! Shit. What was the three number thing? It was like five, five, four, two? Eh? 
Hey, I remember. Yes. I thought that only worked in the movies. Don't be so happy, Max. Open sesame. Ugh. This looks creepy. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Probably. Come on. <clears throat> What the hell is this? Ugh. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. Keep searching, Chloe. Ah, the Apocalypse Entertainment System. Wow. The files! from the end of each episode. Because it always showed Rachel's. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Victoria, Kate, and Okay. Rachel, A binder up. marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh Kate no, Kate. Perfect. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. Ugh. Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning the dose search tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. Fuck. This can't be real. These are all... These are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's... out of it. Maybe... Maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard! Max, we have to find that spot, now! Th then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead, no way! She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it, please, let's go. Max, trust Chloe and go to the junkyard. Oh, this picture is framed different. Fucking hell. Rachel is awake and fucking Rachel has passed out. This shot is so staged. I can't believe it's real. I can't. Max, move faster, please. That'd be much appreciated. Go to the junkyard. Oh, junkyards. Yeah. Shit. Skirt. I'm guessing they'd probably closed everything over. Drift. That one makes sense Chloe, by the shirt. Was Wait there. for me. Max I know can't exactly run. where I'm going. I don't know where the shirt was lying before. I come in front of the car. Or am I stupid? Look, this is it. This is it. Are you gonna help me, Max? Oh, Chloe. Chloe, stop! Look. Please, no. Oh! Oh! That smell! Rachel! Oh. No, Rachel, no, no! Please, not her! <laughs> Chloe. I'm so sorry. Oh no. Whoa. I loved her so much. How can she be dead? What kind of world does this? Who does this? Nathan Prescott. <laughs> That's pretty fucked up. Like, I, I don't know what to fucking say at this moment, but like, oh good jeez. I fucking do again. Why? Like, Max would probably be able to do something to like go 
who, like, if she had a certain picture, she probably could have went back to that time and everything, but, you know, we still have one more episode of this, so, you know, Whew. that took a lot longer than expected, but, like, party. Is this the next sequence? Like, as in the next part of this episode? Fuck. Is this like the trailer, but for next week? I hope Nathan next enjoys his tomorrow. last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is going to get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? Right. I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. Right. Eclipse. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is there that? Can't be too much. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. It's beautiful. Oh. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. For two moons. It's like Tatooine and it's two suns or some shit. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you alright after today? I really flipped out on Nathan. I just hate bullies. And Max, he's dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, it's okay. we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not well, to me, say Warren. That. Text soon. <sighs> aye, aye. Max. I don't have to fall over, or not be a good idea. Scrolled, right. Hi, can I take your coat or anything? No, I didn't see any tablet with cat pics. Okay, Chloe, <clears throat> where the hell are you? Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. It, it. Hey, Max. Welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Why does Nathan creep you out? He should. I, I just want your reasons. He's a bully for one thing, and he hit Warren for another. But have you ever looked at his eyes? Glazed and raging. Me no like. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Do you notice anything unusual about the Vortex Club tonight? Yeah, I notice they don't give a shit about Kate Marsh. 
I'm glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have canceled the party. Guess I'm not cool enough. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Thank you, person. I can't remember. Brooke. Brooke. What's your name? Stella. No. I don't know. Whichever. I love this song. Flashing lights. Where's the cat up? More importantly, where's Chloe in this shit heap of stuff? Ah, oh, that's sore in my eyes. Oh no. Really? We need to find Nathan and take him down. I need to find fucking Chloe first to see where she's going. Justin said somebody saw two moons outside. I bet Justin. Melissa, please be of use. Let's out. Let's out, Warren. Melissa, incoming! I'm on it. Of course you stepped up to protect me from another humiliating moment. Thank you, Max. Yay! Alyssa, I need to speak to you. see you here. Same. Um... Alyssa, I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section. Like it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Oh. Good luck. Thanks, Alyssa. That's nice. He's just dickhead. I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. No, fuck you. Let her in. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Why isn't Courtney guarding the list for the VIP section? Glow sticks. What would a shitty party be without glow sticks? Exactly. Um, open. That was easy. What are you doing in here? Oh, who's in that shit? If I get sick now, I can drink. Yo, maximum overdrive. About time you got here to save this uh, lame maximum. rave. You wanna get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. I can agree. Nathan. Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore text club. Okay. Fucking hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? Please let me skip this. How about a quick dab? Uh no, I'm I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus! You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. What the hell's that knocking? It's time to get my board and grind. 
no, don't, because you'll hurt yourself. Hey. Oh, it's hurt knocking on the fucking door. Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Ugh, Max. Yeah, really? I'm never leaving this toilet. But you're not the only one who has to get this sick. Apparently, Blackwell has a severe you toilet paper go. fetish. Right, so there's no block entrance, huh? Um, frick. I've always had to like slip in somehow. Who's this? Courtney. Hey, Courtney. How are you? Uh, what is Max Caulfield doing at a Vortex Club party? <laughs> it really must be the end of the world. <laughs> Get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP section. Yes, it is very nice. If you're in the Vortex Club, which you're not and will never be. So, excuse me. What must I do to get into the Vortex Club, seriously? What's Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP section. Nice to chat up another anime geek. Oh yes, I'm a multi-purpose geek. You are. That's Brooke. That's what I like about Warren. He's more into science, though, right? Yeah, but so am I. I like science fiction. Uh, what the flying frick? Like, I'm a proper fucking confused lane rail. Push. Keep your head down, Max. It's okay. Oh my God, DJ Zero is checking me out. Right. Party, you not cool. Yes, you. Right. Rewind before that happened. Please go faster. Much appreciated. Enter. Finally. Nathan is the Vortex Club. Kate, what's up? Thank you so much for coming. Bye, Max. Left my heart. Kate, I was so happy to see you smile again. Uh, I have got, I've got to go, but also want to say have fun at the movies. You weren't too sweet. You brought my some school books. I need to give him a hug for me. Hey, well, call me as soon as you can. So his ass uh, has to be here tonight. That VIP section is so lame. You did worse than like my dad. dad. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. So Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, you Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. You still pissed about me taking your picture? Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. Oh, I'm not. Nathan. I blame Nathan for dosing Kate, but nobody at that party even cared she was so wasted. It's a fucking party. Everybody is wasted. What do you want from me? I so want humanity, to. Victoria. Well, you got Nathan busted out of Blackwell, so you should be happy. And I'm the only person here who cares what Nathan is going through. This is bigger than a problem, child. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. No. Oh. You have talent. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. Yeah, Mr. Jefferson probably won't be choosing my photo. I'm not as talented as I thought. Yes, you are. But we shouldn't have to choose between talent and kindness. I hope. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. 
clearly. But... Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reasons you think. Oh, you look so serious. Oh, sarcasm is not helping. Darkroom. Victoria, enough of this high school bullshit. We're adults now. So listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know you're close to Nathan, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her someplace. Dark. Oh my god. And I'm the drama queen? Touche. But I am not fucking around here. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not, but you have to believe me. I don't believe anything you say. You're full of shit. Oh, hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Now, will you listen? No, I won't. You're just Slapper. pissed because you didn't enter a photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist would have busted ass to win, but you just want to take your little retro selfies. That is so fucking lame and lazy, Max. Just please, go find a community please, college. Just... Oh, Victoria, please Punch don't her. do this. Especially after what happened with Kate. Can't you see I'm serious? That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world, so I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Adios. Finally we'll shows walk. up. Where the fuck's she been? She probably took the long way around. Okay, I tried. I mean, she's not gonna be- There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it, Max. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> Are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He... He seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. This is nearly going to be a three-hour stream. Holy shit. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, but I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Hmm. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. Uh, he cuts All of you represent Blackwell Academy. And everything you need our to school stands for. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. <laughs> the envelope, please. And the winner is... Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Fuck off, Victoria. Nobody cares. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. Uh... I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. To Kate Marsh. Mm. <laughs> 
She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell. And I can't wait for her to come back. I don't know how serious she's Thank been. You. I would love to just push Sorry, her on the f- <laughs> Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. The dormitories? Why don't you just call them the dorms? That would be much worse. Yeah. Christ, Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Gotta go faster. And that moon is starting to fade away. Oh, jeez. What else could be left to this bloody story? Okay, there's back to one moon. That's a start. Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. If she can, which I don't see why she couldn't. Well, Chloe had two guns as well. Either she could go in, guns to each hand, or give freaking her one, like Max one. You know, different options, Chloe. Or at least have both on her in case. Max, when we catch Nathan, you better rewind so I can kill him over and over. Oh, for God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. We could die, okay? And Max dies. Fuck. Like, if Max ends up getting killed, then this whole shit, like, everything's. So creepy out here. Fucked up. You're gonna suffer, Nathan. Shh. Max, please hurry! Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Take a picture, Max. Oh, no. Ah, oh, no. Rewind's powers aren't working. Chloe! Look how- What the fuck? For fuck's sake. Ah. Uh. Jesus Christ. Neath or Mr. Jefferson? Mr. Jefferson. Good God Almighty. That's the worst ending yet to any of these bloody episodes. No. I'm skipping the blat. You accept Chloe's request, okay. Well, most people did actually. Uh, Warren beat up Nathan, yeah. No one got hurt. Victoria didn't believe me. Um. Huh. Okay, that's a dark room this time. Victoria. Or both. Once again, Life Strange Episode 5 Polarized. Coming next time. Slash tomorrow. Guys, thank you for sitting through this. If you have, this is a lot longer than I expected. You know, it's been 
about two hours and fifty minutes roughly. It could have been a lot shorter if I had of not been a complete and utter plunker whenever it came to that section with matching everything up and the like password section. But you know, to me, I'm not surprised. As always, guys, if you like this, hit the like button, share, comment, subscribe with the notification bell, send you guys know when I go live. I'm gonna upload all that good stuff. Also in the comment section, I'll put this in at the end of this one and start and end of next one. If you would like me to see, or if you would like to see the Before the Storm, like the prequel stories between, I believe it's Chloe and Rachel, like in those five years leading up to this game, then please let me know, because I have those and it would be nice to play them. So, yeah. Guys, thanks for watching, as always, and I shall see you guys tomorrow with the last episode of this. Goodbye.